Here we have the E-Move Cruiser, about a year and a half old. Key start, full LCD. nicely good acceleration the handlebars are a bit towards the rider so it gives you a bit of an angled grip Cut through some traffic here. We're hitting a top speed of around 19, 20 miles an hour on flat ground. After about a year and a half, two years, if you're not respecting the scooter, it can really put some wear and tear on it. And it seems like this one was not taken well care of. It does still go, but it's sluggish. I don't imagine that's the case had you had the person taking care of it correctly. All right, now we're going up to 28 miles an hour. Cruising nicely, pretty soft. Let's try the brakes. Brakes are gradual. Seems like a fun scooter to get to and from point A and point B. I wouldn't be using this on the beach or off-road or anything like that. It's more of a city type scooter. The throttle is a little bit jumpy. Just something to be aware of. But as you can see, it handles pretty nicely. Again, like I said, that throttle is just a little bit hairy jumpy. Going up a hill. Seems to have pretty good hill climb. Carrying me up at 25. Now we're getting into 28, 29. It is a smaller scooter to go as fast on. I think ideally I'd like something a little bit more built up, a little bigger, that gives you a little bit more handling. Going 30 on this thing is a little bit shaky.
taking a turn here. Accelerate off the turn. Again, after one, after two years of use, heavy use, if you're not respecting the scooter, the motor can get sluggish. It's really important to be taking care of the scooter and respecting it, not driving it in the rain. has a nice stable platform with some suspension on it which is nice like I said again this isn't the type of thing that you'd use for off-road or for the beach this is something that you'd use for commuting for, through the city or through the suburbs does have cruise control that sets up after you hold the accelerator for a certain amount of time. Again, on a scooter this fast, I'd like to see a little bit more built up handlebars. Just something that gives it a little bit more stability. Overall, it's a pretty good design. A nice sturdy platform. It has that suspension. Caliper brakes. control is a little sticky I don't know that I enjoy it so much but it's just something that would take some getting used to and here we go we'll end the ride back at the shop thanks for watching guys this is the e-move cruiser and we'll see you next time